Hi friends, in this video we will see the static variables in Java. Now we will use the static variables if I want to implement some common functionality for the class. Suppose there is a class say class employee and for that class employee I want to count the number of objects. Then to count the number of objects I have to declare one counter variable but that counter variable should have common copy for each object. So in such scenario we will make use of static keyword. So for static instance variable you need to remember few things like first thing is the for static instance variable only one copy exists which is shared by all the object. Now second thing about static instance variable it can be initialized at the point of declaration or it can be also initialized within a static block. And third thing about static is as static instance variables are there there are static methods and static methods can be called using class name. The syntax to call the static method is class name dot variable name. Apart from that static instance variables are as good as ordinary instance variables. So what I am talking about is suppose I am implementing the program of counting objects then say there are three objects. which are say E1, E2 and E3 for a employee class. Then C counter variable for all three objects should be common. So that variable which is say CNT I have to declare that as static variable. In this example they have shown salary variable as static and they have printed that in main itself because it is this method is the method of the same class. So now we will implement this particular thing practically. Now to see the demo regarding class variables or static variables you can refer to this class which is the employee class. In this class there are two variables which are declared static. One is salary attribute and other is department attribute. Now because they are static only one copy for them will exist which is shared by all the object. So if I update salary here then I do not need to make use of some object. I can simply write salary equals to 1000. After that I am printing the department value and salary value. If I run this code department value is development which is printed here and salary is 1000 which is printed here. Now they can be also accessed by objects. So suppose I have two objects of employee one is employee E1 equals to new employee and one more object is E2. Then even I can access those static variables through the object. If I say E1 dot salary equals to I change the value say 9999 and while printing I am printing say E2 dot salary. Then Let me check the output. I say here e2 dot salary. The salary for e2 is 9999. Though I have printed even employee salary, e2 salary also printed as updated value because both salaries are not different. There is common copy of salary variable which is shared by e1 and e2. 